Scheduling for November and December of 2024 is just around the corner, and it's time for you to take a few minutes and put in your block out dates. Uh, starting today, September 30th, uh, 2024, uh, we're asking you to go in, and for the next week, you've got an open window to go in and put in block out dates. These are any dates that you're unavailable to serve during the months of November and December. So I'm going to take just a moment today and walk you through the process. For first on the desktop and then on the smartphone app. So if you open up your desktop window, go to services.planningcenter.com, it should default to the plans page. And I should say that URL is services.planningcenteronline.com, defaults to the plans page. And what you need to do is go over here and click on the tab that says my schedule. Uh, once there, you'll see a list of all of your upcoming services. And then over on the left side of the screen, click the button that says add blockouts. There you can go in and you can add any dates that you're not available to serve, I should say. So let's say you're going to be out on November 17th. Uh, what you'll do is you'll go in here and you'll click the November 17th button. And you might just say uh, traveling out of town. Um, give just put some type of reason in there um, just just so we're all communicating and on the same page so November 17th if you hit that as a block out now if we go in and try to schedule you for that weekend there will be a red box show up next to your name indicating that you are unavailable if you put in a block out date and you need to go back and change it all you have to do is come in here click on the block out date and hit delete block out and that will take it off your schedule and then you will it'll show that you're available again to serve on that day. Let's go over to the iPhone app now and take a look at how to submit block out dates uh, on uh, via via smartphone. This works on uh, iOS and Android. First, you'll want to make sure that you've downloaded the Planning Center Services tab. This is different than the Music Stand tab, uh, the Music Stand app, I should say. So click on the Services app and it will probably default to the plans tab again. Uh, click right there at the bottom to the left, click on the schedule tab, and up here at the top, you'll see that there's an option to add a blockout. Same thing, click add blockout. You can put in your same reason here, traveling out of town. We'll select uh, November 17th again. And if both you and your spouse serve on the worship team, if you're, collect if you're connected as a family, in PCO, you can just click their name at the top and that'll add a block out for them as well. I'm going to turn that off here. And if you hit the check mark at the top of the screen, you'll see now that November 17th is saved as a block out date. If you need to get rid of that, just click on it and at the bottom right click delete block out. I should say both on the smartphone app and the desktop app, you can go in and uh, set a recurring block out. Let's say that, you know, the third Sunday of every month, you're going to be serving in another ministry somewhere. You can put that in as a block out and that'll let us know not to schedule you for the worship team on those Sundays. I hope that's helpful. Please take a moment uh, between now and Monday, October 7th to put in all of your block out dates and then your team leaders next week will take some time, put your schedules together and get them sent out to you. That way you'll know what your service schedule is going to look like between now and the end of 2024. Feel free to reach out if you have any questions.